We want melody to sound flowing. We don't want to sound ta ti ta 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 ta. You're not doing that bad. I'm just exaggerating. Now sometimes it sounds like your your notes all go uneven in dynamics. Some sound too loud. Some sound too soft. And you know why it's happening? Because you're lifting your fingers. High. And when we lift fingers not on the same height, then our sounds go, uh, become different. So it's very important to stay close so you can feel. If I go like that, see how uneven the melody becomes. And your fingers kind of, I know you're trying to be very expressive, but I'd like you right now to try one more time and try to stay closer to the keys so your fingers are more sensitive. So they kind of touch the keys before playing. Yes? Now, here in the last line, this part is the same as these two. And here you're holding B flat very well. And here you forget. So just remember to do it too. And in this ending, which you also learned very well, I really need you to feel this is the same melody. So these notes really should project and the rest should be quiet. But shut up. So two goals right now. First is to make the melody very smooth and even all the sounds. Not like da 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 da, but like one line. Da, 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 right? What? And the other one to remember to bring up bring out the melody in the chords. Ready?
start a little bit deeper. No, no, not the first note. 